Hey friends, Aiden here, and this is my third vlog out of 500. I'm doing 500 vlogs for Bipolar, and I'm raising funds and awareness for Lifeline. Um, yeah, so a couple of things I want to talk about today. Yesterday was not the best day. Um, for those of you who have been following me from before, um, you will know that I'm recovering from a slight depression. Um, basically... I had a manic scare, and then they, my doctor told me to stop taking my antidepressants, um, and then I got depressed, and now I'm on a small dose of antidepressants, and my depression is lifting, but I'm still a bit depressed. My mood has been much better, much better, much better, much better, and for that I'm very grateful, but my energy levels have not been so great, and yesterday was a bad day. Um, I woke up late, I've actually got um, an assistant who calls me at 7 o'clock to wake me up, and then I went back to bed after she woke me up, uh, sorry Liesl, and I went to have a nap, it was just supposed to be a nap at about 4 o'clock, and I got woken up at 8, so if I wasn't woken up, I would have carried on sleeping. So yeah, yesterday wasn't great, um, I didn't get much done on my power list like I said I would, I just, you know, I just lumbed out for the rest of the evening, so yeah, yesterday was not a great day. The thing I want to talk to you about today is something that has been um, swimming around in my mind for the last few weeks and months, um, and it's becoming more and more important to me, um, and that is, I need to make money. So, um, there's a saying that goes, health is wealth, but I believe that the other way around is also true in the case of mental health, and that is wealth is health, because until I get my finances together, I'm not going to be, my mental health is not going to be what it should be, and that's because um, even though I'm very, very grateful for all the support that my parents have given me over the years, um, I don't feel good about, I don't feel good about needing it. Um, and I love them so much for looking after me for so long. Um, but I know that if they didn't have to take such care of me as an adult, that my parents' finances would be in a better situation than they are now. So I've actually set a goal. I'm being coached by my little brother, and I'm being coached by... Uh, that's Babu, and I'm being coached by my best friend, Emma. And one of my goals in three years is to help my dad retire because my dad is still working and it's not because he loves his job. It's because he needs to, to pay the expenses. And I know that he's, he would be in a better position if he didn't have to look after his bipolar son. So I need to make money now. Um, I've taken some steps. I'm doing some things, uh, but they haven't really turned into uh, cash just yet, but I'm remaining positive and optimistic. Um, I've actually got two jobs. My friend Joe has got two businesses. One is a commercial property business uh, where we find people premises for their business and like offices, shops, factories, that type of thing. And the other business he has is a woodworking business where he makes furniture out of reclaimed wood. So it's two commission-based jobs. Um, I haven't sold a piece of furniture yet and I haven't put someone in premises yet, so I haven't made a commission yet. So that's a little frustrating, but I'm trying to stay optimistic and do what I can uh, to, to make each of them work worthwhile. The other thing that I'm doing, which I'm really excited about, is I'm coaching. Um, I have been doing some advertising. I've gotten a, a, a page um, on Facebook and on Instagram for my coaching business called Abracadabra Coaching. Um, and at the moment, I'm coaching a few people, uh, but I'm doing trade exchanges, and those are great because I'm getting value in return, but I'm not getting cash. I'm not getting money. Yet. I'm going to say yet. Um, the other idea that I've got um, for making money is um, inspired by my virtual assistant, Liesl, is I thought about becoming an assistant, um, but like a part-time assistant to anybody that needs an assistant. Um, and I'm thinking of doing it for my friends only uh, because I'm, I've discovered my purpose, like I said in my last video of being the world's best friend. I want to help my friends, especially my friends with businesses, make money. And I want to do all the non-essential stuff that anyone can do. Um, 
I'll make the coffee, I'll make the lunch, I'll make the tea. Um, and basically, I want to do all the things that are non-essential, the things that don't make direct, uh, that don't directly make money, so that the entrepreneur, my friend, can focus on making money stuff. And yeah, so that's a new idea that I've got, and that's going to be called uh, Everyone's PA. Um, but yeah, these are all fledgling things. So if you want to help me make money, please add me on Facebook. Um, my name on Facebook is Aiden van Reinefeld. That's A-D-I-N. Because uh, I share all my work-related uh, stuff on Facebook as well. And I've got different pages for them. So if you follow me on Facebook, you'll know what the, what the right pages are. And if you could like it, comment, share, give me a little bit of support, I'd really appreciate it. Um, because I really want to achieve my goal of helping my dad retire in three years. And I want to start contributing now, already. Yeah, that's all I want to say for today. I had a shit day yesterday and I need to make money. That's the gist of it. Um, if you want to support Lifeline, please help me reach my goal of raising 50,000 Rand for Lifeline in three years. Um, if you are watching this on Instagram, go to Lifeline WC to follow Lifeline. If you're watching this on Facebook, go to Lifeline Western Cape. On That's the Facebook page. Um, and if you want to donate, please, please, please go to giveandgain.com. All right, guys, I will send you another video in two days. Much love.